this is the landing screen when we open the app for the first time bottom left side configure application just open it now we need to create a profile which is nothing but an iptv service account scroll down to profile and open it select new profile and open it there are three steps here profile name portal settings and stb configuration please pause in this slide take all the notes before proceeding name name can be anything pressing okay button will bring up the keyboard i am just calling it tv1 press okay to save it next is portal settings this is the server address delete the default portal url and enter here what your service provider has given for demo purpose i have entered a real service so it is masked next is stb configuration take a look at this page you see a mac address there just send as it is to your service provider next is device id below just open it and check mark top two boxes choose mac based device id and send device id both of them to be ticked now keep hitting the return button keep hitting till you reach the blue screen perfect press menu button on the remote and you will see a settings drop down from top right side of the screen scroll down select profile and press okay and you see the profile we created tv1 press open it authentication screen this means all our entries are correct and this is the time you send your mac address to your service provider for activation just in case you missed it go back to step 3 and get your mac address after activation you can open the app from the home screen restart the app after the profile is activated server connects and channel start loading just in case you don't see any picture scroll down to media player open it and select ljk you can see the ljk selection bringing the picture back to the screen the iptv setup is now complete once inside the app any time you press the menu button to see the settings drop down feel free to post your comments and questions you can also email with the link given below thanks for watching